Two months after a horrific triple murder was discovered in Pensacola, no one has been arrested nor charged. Neighbors on Deerfield Drive are starting to move on with their lives, but say the crime continues to haunt them. News 5's Debbie Williams has the story. A construction dumpster and storage units lined the drive and front yard of the Deerfield Drive home where Bonnie Smith and two of her sons were murdered this past summer. The sheriff called it a ritualistic killing, even saying there were elements of witchcraft involved. Two months later, very little information has been released to the public about the status of the investigation, only that investigators are waiting for forensic test results. Everybody is uh, still uptight because we don't know what's going on. Willard Meeks has lived in this neighborhood for 20 years. You have no idea what happened back there. Just wish I did so we could clear it up, but I can't help. There's nothing I can do. Wish I could. In my mind, I said, it looked like we could clear this up so we could be comfortable. We talked to several folks in the neighborhood who didn't want to appear on camera who say things are slowly starting to return to normal here in the neighborhood, but there's still an uneasiness, a fear factor, because an arrest has not been made. We not, can't even be comfortable no more until this is so. For sale signs have started popping up in the neighborhood. Some say it's because of the murders. Others say they hope investigators will make an arrest soon so their quiet little neighborhood will feel more like their home instead of a crime scene. In Pensacola, Debbie Williams, News 5. A spokesman with the sheriff's office says there was an enormous amount of evidence taken from the crime scene. Investigators are still waiting on results of DNA evidence.